snuffers. Welcome back, simply snuff time. It's a bit windy, a bit windy this morning. Here I am in Whitby, outside Mr. Chips. You ever watch Top Gear? You might watch Top Gear, they quite often have been in Whitby and they did uh, one of the Grand Tour shows and uh, this is their favourite fish and chip shop, Mr. Chips. They eat here and they did all the catering for the Grand Tour when they were over in the harbour. There you are, little interesting fact. You wondered why Jeremy Clarkson was so fat. <laughs> well now you know. <laughs> so I've just been down to my bricks and mortar shop. Uh, the Black Swan Shoppy and uh, I've got a fresh tin of their number three most favourite snuff in Whitby. Sorry chaps, oh, I'll leave that there for a moment. And uh, it happens to be one of my top banana snuffs and it's Hedger's L260 The Snuff. This is the third most popular selling snuff in Whitby and the lady thinks it's probably because it's a big tin and it's a little bit more expensive than the other snuffs. I think I paid £3.45 for this 20 gram tin. Um, it's manufactured by um, Mac Baron Tobacco Company in Denmark, so it's another one of their snuffs. I've reviewed this before, I absolutely adore it. That's why, for me, never mind what they think here in Whitby is number three stuff, snuff, it's one of my top bananas. Absolutely nailed on. I bloody love this stuff. I've got a brand new, fresh tin. Oh man, I'm looking forward to this. So let's get the tin off. Look at that. Absolutely divine. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. Tin's crammed full. 20 grams of absolute delightfulness. The base flower, absolutely dreamy. But there's moisture in you can tell it's not blowing all over the place so you know it's got plenty of moisture in it you're getting a great base flower coming out of it you're getting that great smell and you're getting a big bold menthol coming straight from the tin oh it's been around for years apparently the 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 recipe dates back to the 1800s apparently anyway enough of that nonsense i'm gonna get some of this up my nose let's have a pinch <laughs> going to be a fine medium grind but no 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 fine grind oh. hey, it's quite refreshing as well you know that menthol just gives you an absolute buzz out of it absolutely full on if you're not ready for a, a portion of fish and chips after this <laughs> you might as well pack it in anyway mrs m's gone home <laughs> Yes! <laughs> I'll be down at supermarket. Get me send a, a bottle of wine. <laughs> Come about half past eight, I'll be spaced out. <laughs> Good job she didn't watch these videos, innit? I'll be at divorce court, she clear me out. Every penny I have or every penny I, I haven't got. Oh, mates, Whitby's number three stuff, 
snuff why this isn't number one I have no bloody idea I haven't a clue I, 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 can't, I, I can't Adam and Eve it for me this is a top banana snuff but it is whip is number three but I think it's because it comes in a big tin it's 20 grams of it and people tend to go for the smaller tins and you know maybe the 10 gram tins and, and that type of stuff I don't know I'm making that shit up I don't really know why but what I do know is it's a fantastic snuff it's fine grind great base flower great mental nice moisture in it as I say it's a fine grind got a fantastic burn in it just sits on your in your nose and it keeps on giving just keeps on giving I'm gonna have another one because you know I just can't resist sorry spilling it all over as bloody usual so two in one and we got edges L260 the snuff number three in Whitby but it's one of my top bananas that's it I've said it I've said it thanks for watching We'll see you next time. You keep well. Chin chin.